it is time now to catch up with Khloe Kardashian. Her reality television career is skyrocketing right now and her business is booming. And now she's involved in a great campaign that is aimed at helping young women uh, get more in touch with their bodies and feel better yeah. about their bodies. And yeah. we're delighted to have you here this morning. Thank you. Tell I'm me so about excited. this campaign. It's called Generation No. Well, um, this is the third year that I've partnered with you by Kotex. Mm -hmm. And it was such an honor to me to be asked this because there's so many girls in my family, but um, yes, there are. There are. <laughs> but when you're young, I have two older sisters, and one's five years older, one's three years older. And when I was a teenager, I really didn't have anybody to go to um, to ask, you know, the things that you're embarrassed about or that you might feel uncomfortable asking anybody. So for my little sisters, I've always made them feel you didn't so, go to your big sisters or your no mom? i just felt like they were like because they were five years like when you're 10 and one's 15 right you're still kind of embarrassed so i i would go to my mom but you don't ask everything you really want to ask so, so what kinds of questions can girls go there and ask and and, and well, you could go might be to, to generationno.com mm -hmm. and um there's MythBusters, which i love because there's so many things that people tell you um right. that you might think is true or not true and it's a forum to go on there, ask questions if you are too embarrassed, sign up, people could help you, you get to bust all these myths. It's just so informative and I love that because I have two little sisters right. and if they don't want to ask me something, I direct them. Well, I've got to, to say, Chloe, after seeing a couple episodes of your show, you guys pretty much bust every myth and talk about <laughs> every un, sort of off-limits topic. We do. You are not shy on that. We're and not that's part shy. Of the, the no, of the show. we're not shy. So it's, you, it's all out there. It is all out there, and you know that is the blessing of being so close with the family. But mm. there's still, like, even in school, like I wasn't taught certain things about my body or even I was comfortable asking so even as honest or as comfortable as you are with your own skin sometimes it's nowadays with social media it's easier maybe to hide behind a computer sure. screen log online and ask the questions that way. You, of course, are not just on your, your family's many constellation of shows. <laughs> you were also on The X Factor this season. Uh, was it yes. fun being one of the hosts of that show? It was so fun. It was my first time ever hosting anything, especially live TV. Um, I felt like with every show, I got better and better in my confidence. Mm -hmm. I felt like at the very last show, I was like, wait, I've just got in the groove, and oh, it's no. over. Who's but gonna take Britney Spears' place and Ellie Reid's no place? I have no idea. Oh, wow. I have no idea. And big changes I, in the Big changes. There. But I was hired a week before the show aired, aired, so I feel like Simon might do the same thing. Oh, no. Okay. He loves to... Wait until the very last yeah, minute. Yeah, the suspense. Um, you, of course, uh, your family is expanding. You're about to be an aunt again. Yes. Your sister Kim is pregnant. Yeah. And I know you and Lamar have been trying to start your own family. Um, how is that going? I mean, I don't want to ask details, but, you know, um, fertility has often been an issue for a lot of women yeah. in this country. You guys are very upfront on the show about a lot of things. You know what? And I've always been really open and honest about it, and that is one of the best things Kimberly is actually the one who made me kind of go to the doctor and check my body and mm -hmm. figure out what was wrong, if anything. And that's that is also why I'm so proud to be a part of a brand like you by Kotex, because that's what we're encouraging women just to be aware of their bodies um, and to know if there are issues, if you have questions, concerns. And, you know, right now, Lamar and I, we're not. Okay. I've been married three years. We're still enjoying the newlywed phase. Good luck with that. Thank you. I think you'll be a great mom. And I you're think already so a great too. Aunt, so. And I'm excited to have another niece or nephew. Well, good luck. Yeah. With that. <laughs> Thank right, we'll you. Be right back. Thanks, Glory. Thank you.